Later, Dr. Fire, Dr. Water, and Dr. Air all retreated to an abandoned dumpster. If they were to stand a chance, Dr. Water and Dr. Air figured there was strength in numbers. They wanted Dr. Fire to join them, but he refused. He was confident he could destroy every last vehicle on his own. Dr. Water and Dr. Air gave up. For all they cared, he could let himself be killed. <coughs> Meanwhile, the fire department had an urgent call to respond to. A home had burst into flames. Fortunately, everyone had escaped in time, but the fire could spread. They had to put it out immediately. After hours of work, the house was nothing but a pile of ashes, but as the team returned to the fire station, there was another fire to be taken down. Dr. Fire had returned. Backup came and shot him. He was defeated. The army had still become vulnerable. Taking advantage of this, Dr. Water and Dr. Air attacked. The tanks and airplanes were no match for them together. There really was strength in numbers. There was no question about it. Sir Hadi Makati had to fight again. He couldn't win. If he attacked one of the dinosaurs, the other would attack him back. The tanks and airplanes fired back. Distracted by Sir Hadi Makati, Dr. Water and Dr. Air were defeated. The city realized Sir Hadi Makati was still needed in this war. He left behind his job as a firefighter to fight the dinosaurs again. 